everyone welcome back to another weekly vlog so today it is wednesday the 23rd of march and it is a beautiful day today i absolutely look like death because i've been up since four o'clock for work i finished at quarter to 12 so i'm now home i've had my lunch i've had a lovely shower i've washed my hair there's something better than washing your hair um but anyway i am actually going to be delivering some leaflets locally to the salon which i find super awkward if people are sat by the window or something or have like a ring doorbell or like this outside it's really awkward because like you don't know what to say and like you feel as if you're being watched because they obviously kind of they're pushing something through the door but anyway i am they're gonna take some leaflets i don't know how many i need to take i don't really know how many houses are uh, the way I'm going to take, I think I'll take a hundred, but I don't think I'll end up pushing a hundred through because obviously there is enough houses. But yeah, but anyway, I'm I'm looking forward to that obviously. But at least it is a lovely day. Only thing is, because it's lovely weather, people might be doing some gardening or something. But I'm just gonna have to get over myself. Oh guys, I am back home now from literally pushing flies through people's doors. I've probably been out for almost an hour. I'd say fifty minutes. I've had these trainers on, and because they're the brand new trainers. The new trainers can sometimes rub you can't this kind of have they rub slightly on my ankles but honestly i'm so happy to be home i need a drink it's actually so warm out there and here's me with a bloody sweatshirt on gym pants i mean gym pants are fine but it's more the, the sweatshirt and these heavy trainers oh my god they're so heavy but yeah i've done the whole house and stay and i had to come back for more flies because um i hadn't brought enough I was putting my shoes in here guys because obviously I want to keep them where they need to be but yeah I'm just happy to be back home I've got some work to do so not very exciting but I'm going to do some advertising for the business I am going to oh, what else am I going to do I am also I don't even know what I was going to do I was going to do something else I was going to do advertising and some editing yeah that's what I was going to do. I forgot to mention that these beautiful packs of bunny tails actually arrived. I actually ordered them from AliExpress, I believe, and I have actually ordered quite a few dried flower bits, but they weren't. They meant to arrive until May time, but these bunny tails have already arrived. I think I've ordered possibly 30 of each colour, so I've, I ordered a nude and pink, and then I ordered some pampas and other the kind of stuff and these were actually from scott they're these red ones yeah but i love the bunny tails a lot i can also put these in different vases i think it'd be too much having them all in there i'm just keeping them bunched up at the moment it just kind of stops them from losing a lot of the the kind of fluff on them because i'm also going to have to wait a little while for the other ones to arrive but aliexpress highly recommend i've never ordered off there before until now um I've not actually had a look at design stuff on there, but if you want me to film a test in AliExpress kind of haul, please let me know. Yeah, but these are very pretty, and obviously these vases are so cute. It's from the range, nine ninety nine. I think it's such a bargain for the price, but yeah, I'm very happy with these. I've just finished filming the video, guys, so it, it was also reviewing this gorgeous handbag here. I'm very happy. Please make sure to watch that. A lot of you, I've, it, it should already be up before this vlog, but yeah, but basically this camera, I have had ever since I think it was either my 14th or 15th birthday and I'm now 20 so it's been with me for a long time. I was actually thinking the other day of investing in a, a vlogging camera and I know that I used to say this in a lot of my old vlogs but it's getting to the stage where in my phone storage is actually getting full of videos instead of photos and apps and stuff and these days our phones are used for absolutely everything like payment, the booking things, like storing information and stuff. Like the you know, things in general, we need our phones for a lot of stuff. So vlogging is probably not the best thing to do with my phone at the moment. But basically, it means Scott they've obviously booked a holiday in May and I think I might have told the last week's vlog, but if you don't already know, basically it means we're going to Croatia in May time. We had to renew our passports because they both expired a couple of months ago. It was strangely enough, they both expired in like the same kind of time range. And we sent off 
our old passport and in mine it's going to Glasgow and Scott is going to Liverpool. Basically Scott has already been printed. Like his new passport has already been printed and it's gonna be sent out to him soon. I have not had any updates on mine. It basically says on in my passport tracking thing that I need to send in my old passport. So I'm really worried in case you don't actually realise it's been delivered because it has been delivered because I've actually been tracking on the Royal Mail because obviously the old passport is a very important document. It, you know, it's got like your own personal information on it and you know, it's got to be in very safe hands. So I'm hoping, fingers crossed, that they're both going to arrive before our whole day. It sounds as if the Scots passport is already on the way. Um, but I don't have any updates on mine, so I'm I'm hoping maybe there's I'm hoping maybe there's a slight delay. Fingers crossed. I'm hoping it's not kind of got lost in the warehouse or wherever it goes to, you know. But yeah, it does kind of make you feel nervous in case you can't get on holiday. Because when I'm filming this, it's six weeks until our holiday, so it's probably not ideal. It, it really isn't ideal. So yeah, <laughs> I'm not kind of stressing because I'm not really that type of person to stress because I am fairly laid back. However, Scott is kind of stressing now and I've just told him like, everything will be fine. But now I'm kind of thinking, crap, like, it's actually going to arrive in time. But who knows? Who blooming knows? You know, I think we had to pay like £80, which is a lot of money to get it renewed. So, you know, but I've heard stories of people's taking like 10 weeks and I'm hoping it won't take... 10 weeks because I don't have 10 weeks to wait. I only have six, it was under six because I obviously need it before holiday. That would not be good, but yeah. Anyway, I'm just packing away my beautiful baby. Whenever I get a new handbag, I, I treat it as if it's a baby and I, I look after it. I mean, I look after all my handbags, but especially new ones, I think it's like with everything you get, isn't it? Like, you also want to take care of it as well as you can. For Mother's Day this year, I'm basically getting my mum one of these i'm not gonna say just because in case she's nearby like the near my bedroom door but i basically got one of these i've actually been offering these for mother's day yes it has a face so it's got a shoulder massage and brow and chin and these are what yeah, this one is worth 30 pounds and i do have the one without the shoulder massage i think for 20 pounds yeah and i've also got like a mother's day card it's actually from tk max yeah very cute yeah the difference between your mind and bond's handwriting is actually so funny but yeah i hate my handwriting but yeah the tk max even has like a little pin as well which makes it really cute and it's is it a simple card but i think it's quite cute um and it's actually going to go in the card and then i'm also i've also got a a box of biscuits from Scott for Mother's Day. So, yeah, you know, it's going to be a nice little present. For this, if I haven't gotten much because this is basically for free, pretty much. But, obviously, this is the value of £30. So, if you look into it, it's quite a lot of money. But, you know what, it's fine. <laughs> I've decided to put my hair in rollers because I just felt like it, to be honest. Like, I straightened my hair earlier on, but... I love having curly hair because I just I think it suits me better, you know, like, I'm not trying to sound vain here, but it does make me feel like I look a lot nicer. Um, it's also some annoying hairs that never go in the rollers because, like, they're too short and stuff. It's usually, like, yeah, the front bit in this roller, at the back it's kind of coming out a bit, but I'm not a hairdresser. I've always struggled with the velcro rollers because i always find them awkward and i feel as if my hair is a really awkward length but i've actually been using these rollers from home bargains the james in london and then i've just been using some kirby grips it kind of grips them in but as you can tell a few bits of hair are coming out i don't know how long to leave them for i just can't use them on dry hair so maybe they may be using it on dry hair isn't the best i don't quite know but, but yeah i'm just watching yeah, the three hauls on YouTube and I've actually waited to have my tea because like at tea time you'll either be my mum or my dad will make tea your dad is 
Yeah, my dad eats better at cooking. Yeah, my mum does know that. Your mum, I wouldn't say she's lazy, but she doesn't enjoy cooking as much as my dad does. And like, she'll usually make us ready meals or... This is making her sound like she's a bad mum, but she's not. I mean, she's an amazing mum, but she like she'll usually put like a pizza in for us or something whereas your dad would more likely make like spaghetti bolognese or something like that these rollers are way too big for my hair um and then you know these rollers are probably just right they're maybe slightly small but like i'm thinking of getting my hair trimmed again because i usually have my hair cut like every 12 weeks because our hairdresser comes every six weeks but i'm not always home to have my hair cut um but yeah so for now, I'm just going to chill with my rollers in. They look like a little old lady. Basically, here are the cupcakes. You can see, it's actually for you know, Grandma Christine off your my mum, because that's like my mum's mum. You know, grandma, look how pretty they are. And then these are for my dad's mum. You know, grandma Jill, so very nice. They look very pretty. Yeah, so cakes you crave, follow. Very good. Yes, they've been kept in this cupboard for now, but yeah, they look very nice. Right, oh my god, it's actually so warm today, guys. So, I I've been working again and I've only just finished. It's not even three o'clock yet, so I think I've done pretty well. Um, honestly, I had to walk home here with three heavy bags. I had the jacket on. Oh my god, I'm absolutely sweating. It's kind of disgusting, I know, but I think I'm going to get changed into shorts. Basically, I'm going to Scott's to stay over, so I am going to have to, like, obviously pack. I actually hate packing, but yeah, I've just got to get things done. Um, I need to make an order for eyelashes, how exciting for those eyelashes. I think I'm going to order from either Primer Lashes, I've never ordered from there before, or Tati. Um, I don't really know. But, yeah, I definitely not need to wear a jacket again, but I'm going to take my Louis Hold haul. Um, honestly, guys, this Hold haul has been a game changer. Um, it's a... Is it the keep all 30 or 35? Not 35, 55. And it's such a good size. It's a Damien one. So good, I love it. But yeah, anyway. And I've just got to pack my makeup. And I've got to pack everything like that. Clothes. I need to check the weather forecast actually. Because, you know, I've got to pack according to the weather. But if it's every day again, I'll be very happy. But yeah, for now. Yeah. Just gonna kind of see what I need to get. Um... And hopefully go from there. So yes, just gonna enjoy the lovely warm weather. We look who I'm with. Scott's been for a run, and I picked him up. Um, mm. Ray Fraser. She didn't pick you up because I was on a run. No, I picked him up I'll, I'll after go. he'd finishes the run, and then like we're going I'll for like a walk around down. here. It's so pretty here. I mean, look at that. Turn the camera around. It's, it's a beautiful pure view. White. The sea is just level. It's not used to running in the heat though, because I've used to running at night time when it's freezing. I know. Oh, challenge. It will be in here. That's 11 seconds off my out, my minute. Oh, well Again. done. Thanks. He's Sorry, been going for like a run every day, pretty much. Um, apart from yesterday, yeah, but it's hard to have a day off sometimes. I know, but I felt awful this morning. You're vlogging here. It reminds me of actually. Hey, don't you dare do that. You're vlogging here actually reminds me of. <laughs> Yeah, when we first started dating and like, we used to go like for walks because Oh you've hurt me too, so I kissed you. Oh sorry. Outfit of the day, Zara. Zara. Balenciaga. <laughs> and Louis Vuitton. Got a holy t shirt. <laughs> joggers. Eh, not joggers. Yeah, that's from Lanzarote, that t shirt. I got you that got on holiday. I know, yeah, because he destroyed it because he doesn't love me now. Because I'm a destroyer. And you got me these shorts from? as well. Oh, oh yeah, next yeah, shorts, outfits. yeah. And I got myself these shoes. Yeah. Oh no, Josh got me them. Did oh they? no, I got me them. Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna buy. I think I might buy myself some new running shoes. You don't need some sunglasses on. No, I like squinting. It's sunny. So it's I've got sunny. a sore head with squinting. I don't yeah, think I didn't want to wear sunglasses while I'm running. No. All right, there's a bus. Oh, well, there's a bus here. Yeah. Your yeah. dad works on it. Yeah, he does. He works in the railway. Whenever your dad's at work, Whenever he's always on track, see. isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> Lol. It's quite a good walk around here though, I like it. It's a lovely day. It's about 18 degrees, it says in the car. What is he doing? It's obviously tool bag. Have you, have you seen my cousin's makeup I did today? Before. Have you seen my cousin's makeup I did today? No. Have a look on the Insta. You follow me at Ellie's home, see if you want to get your makeup done. 16 <laughs> degrees now. Yeah. You said eight, well, you know, when I first got in the car, it said 24 degrees, because obviously cars are, are warmer inside and then 
Yeah, once I was driving for a bit and like I had the windows open and went to 18. But it's going to be 18 degrees tomorrow, so I brought a really cute summer outfit. Still, look how is... close the water is. I didn't even realise it's close. And you can see Scotland, just that Scotland over there, yeah. yeah. Oh my Sometimes god. You can see Isle of Man, but it's not clear. Isle of Man's there. All oh, right. We went all the way up there and passed like a 200 miles up. Yeah, we did. Look at all them rocks. I wonder if you wanted to go camping at the end of May. I'd love that, yep. Yeah. Go camping in Croatia. Oh my god, camping in Croatia. It's very hot. I think we could do it though. Oh, look at us. <laughs> yeah, look at this. Looks very nice. I've been walking up a mountain and there's the lake over down there. We'll it's insert pictures. Yeah, it's not got like a bit to go, but there's a sheep over there, just over there. But yeah, like, this is where we live, guys. So lucky. We are so oh, lucky. So lucky, lucky, lucky. Look at the lovely views. <laughs> This lovely weather. I'm now home, guys. I still have you know, my shades on my head, and I've probably been here for around half an hour. But basically, I've left my purse at Scott's house. Like, how typical is me? I'm always forgetting stuff. Like, the good job he doesn't live ages away because I've been an absolute pain. Luckily, I still have my credit card with me, but. I basically left you know, my debit card and you know, my ID and just like all the bits and bobs. Yeah, but not to worry, I don't think I'm going to need my ID for a while. I've also noticed I've ca I have kind of put a bit of bronzer on my face. Um, and one side's gone really weird, but I don't think, I think I just kind of rushed my makeup. Well, I didn't actually put a lot of makeup on. I just kind of put like bits and bobs on because obviously I've we have going outside and stuff. I've loaded the photo onto Instagram, so make sure to follow my Instagram, Alice.Holmes. Yeah, yeah, so basically, I'm wearing this hoodie now. It's just the Blank Essentials one. It's from TK Maxx and it's really comfortable and it just goes with anything. Yeah, but basically, I actually spilled Pepsi Max on my handbag. And this handbag is in my summer bag, as you can tell. It's by the cool collection. I'm, I'm actually going to use this handbag for my hand, the luggage from me going on holiday. Uh, but basically, I've kind of spilt it on like you know, the leathery bit and like it's stained with the leather on here. But yes, as you can tell, it's very dark. You know, the leather on this bag has actually tanned a lot in the sun. So I think it's all going to go to the same colour eventually anyway. So yeah, not to worry. Yeah, but these shorts are... They're very comfortable, but I think I've got them on like a really tight uh, fitting now and because I've had like my lunch and stuff. They're kind of hurting me a bit, but you know, not to worry. I'm so happy I curled my hair today. Have I forgotten to bring my curlers with me, honestly? Yeah, the sun. It mushes up your brain so much, like it's so bad. But yeah, anyway, that's what I'm going to do. I basically gave my mum her Mother's Day presents. I got her some biscuits from scott and i also got like a voucher for my business so i should be able to use them but you guys probably won't actually believe that i've actually finished work already like it's so light outside the clocks went forward yesterday if i'm right i think that's right uh yes yeah, so i've been working today i really hate my eyebrows and eye makeup but i don't know why i just have those days where i just absolutely hate like you know how after my makeup on one of them days it's just one of them days but i think it's because my hair has gotten slightly light because it obviously went on a walk yesterday in the sun and like my eyebrows are pretty black now but they trust me they're not but yeah anyway i'm in my pjs because if i sound comfortable like you know comfort is key <laughs> i am going to be ending this vlog here because i i'm literally just going to be sorting bookings out because i am like getting fairly busy with the salon now so i've just got to keep on top of it um but yeah just keep on top of it early and then i am just gonna chill so i really hope that you guys have enjoyed if you have please make sure to leave a thumbs up comment down below also subscribe now see you all in my next weekly vlog or next video it depends see you guys